currently closed. You've got to be Please kidding visit me. Us again during our normal business hour. My name is Mike Kovalchuk. For past decade, I've been in the automotive alternative fuel industry, specializing in compressed natural gas. An opportunity has come in my life to expand my talents. Follow me as I get into vehicle restoration and vehicle testing. Check out her voice. It's called Sweet Suspicion by Patty Robinson. Isn't her voice? Good morning. Our main focus for today is to get Raptor over to Rhino Liner, Rhino Lining Company down in Arden uh, so they can start on the uh, tube uh, cylinder cover and the bed cover. It's custom built, so. I'm not gonna vlog step by step because I gotta get this thing done in a hurry. What we're gonna do is take this off, take the cylinder cover off, change the cylinder out, put the new cover on, and then I'll introduce it. I got, there's a sensor right there, it's called Sensadone, Sensanod Blue. It tells you the pressure. So you got an app, you load, and you see that it says zero PSI, 94.8 Fahrenheit inside. But we wanna confirm, make sure there's no pressure in there. So I'm gonna loosen the low pressure line. There you go. And then we're gonna click on, excuse me, ignition on to activate the solenoid. Let's see what it's gonna do. Ready? There we go. We got pressure. I'm pretty sure I did the leak check on it. So I filled up this part, but the valve closed. So there it goes. Thanks, slide. Two? 2021. Is that the grab it? Is it gonna work? Wow. That is nice. We just to them. So basically we are done with the cylinder. We'll tighten everything. We just need to take the cover. The truck with the cover tomorrow to run away. So Let's go to Nelson's and try to get as much as we can done today with the lunar rail and the radiator support. Hey, Andrew! Andrush, let's roll! Oh boy. Yeah, it is pouring. It's pretty bad out there, man. It's leaking inside. Yeah. <laughs> so, Andrew, how do you think we're gonna cut this out? In the muddy yard of cars just like that let me see your train. shoes uh oh these are waterproof oh yeah yeah well i can guarantee you one thing they're not gonna be white anymore <laughs> hi andrew how's it going buddy <laughs> let's roll let's go hop in there we go we're good andrew and i we got rained out because yeah, it's raining, so we could not take off the radiator support. But I'm not ending this vlog yet. This is not over until this project is done. So we are gonna be back, or I am. Andrew, you gonna come out at six o'clock in the morning? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. But uh, six o'clock in the morning, we scheduled an appointment with Nelson to be there early in the morning to cut the radiator support out. And uh, we have to do it, there's no other way, because uh, the guy's waiting for the radiator support to start the car, so. Good morning. 5.11 in the morning. Oh, I barely got any sleep today. That's probably last night, that's for sure. I fell asleep super late. Oh, super late. Oh, it's 5.18, we're running low behind. We had to be in Asheville or Hendersonville at six, but it's okay. We're running a few minutes behind. We gotta get our coffee. So let's go get our venti black eye. But we are currently closed. You've got to be Please kidding me. Please visit us again during our normal business hours. Oh. That sucks. Oh well. All right, let's just keep driving. Should I find a coffee place? I got Dunkin' Donut. I think it's a 65, 85. We'll try to hit that one up. Actually, no, it's not. We're gonna pass it. I guess we have to make it to Asheville. Maybe get a Red Bull. How about that? Out to Nelson's shop and I'm getting my tools ready right now to go down to the car and 
get started. As you guys can see, that already took half the cart apart. And right now, the problem what I ran into is that I forgot my extra battery that I charged. So this battery is low already. Let's see what we can do. Look, it's running low. Battery died. Gotta run to Altec to pick up another battery. Oh well, things like that happen sometimes. Can't be upset about it. You just, you just died, it died. What can you do? Praise God. Uh, <laughs> here's the radiator support. Just unloading all my tools. And let's go drink some coffee and donuts. You see how I cut this out? This is the whole list of front right there. This is what usually takes to, <laughs> to get parts. The more I get into this restoration stuff, the more I start understanding that, man, uh, sometimes you can't buy brand new things. You gotta go to, to yards and find parts and actually cut them out yourself. So I got the part that we needed for the frame guy. Now uh, I just gotta take it over there and uh, I'm gonna let Andrew, my Instagram guy, take photos. So we can, uh, you guys can see on Instagram and exactly in like or whatever comment on it so once again thank you for watching please subscribe follow me like dislike whichever one you want viewers subscribe to my channel to see more of awesomeness <laughs> you can also follow me on Facebook and Twitter <laughs>